Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Ozzy and his Break, son. This is going to be on YouTube as break number 547. This is our first 2017 Panini Donners Elite Football break. We're doing a six box, half case, random divisional break. Uh, we do have the other one filling up. So far, Kane's fan Bob is the only one in that one. Uh, we just kind of uh, pick boxes at random, decided to do the second half. So we're doing boxes 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. Number them as a poor amount of the box. Let's go ahead and go into screen share mode here. And we'll do our dice roll. Always two and up on the randoms. We never accept snake eyes. We always re roll if we roll those. And we'll use the same number to randomize both the divisions and the participants' names. And also we'll use the same number to randomize any. Um, dual or triple autographs or any kind of dual or triples we may have in the case there is a no majority rules rule in my room meaning unless you own 100 percent of the card nobody takes it out right so just an example if there's a three-way card and somebody owns two teams it still goes to random this will be the number we use for all randoms in this case for this break we're going eight times all right have our divisions queued up here AFC East, North, South, and West. NFC East, North, South, and West. Eight times. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. And eight. Just a reminder, everything ships in the breaks. As always, except for veteran base card. If anybody does want any of the veteran base, just get with me after the break. We can make that happen for you. Anything autographed, relic-wise, our numbered will be pink sleeve and top-loaded. Non-numbered inserts and rookies will be sandwiched in between the top-loaded stuff. Try that copy paste again there. All right, and the participants in the order they were taken MWS, Mike, Bogey79, Corey, KNL83, Kevin. Kane's fan Bobby Boy for two, G.I. Budman Steve for one, Brad 8671 for one, and Spike Owen Kelly for one. Once again, we're going eight times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eighth and final time. Good luck, everybody. Kane Sam Bob up top. G.I. Budman on the bottom. Paste those in here. Make this a little easier to read here. Peter did an update a while back and it makes the uh, spreadsheet here come out a little odd when you post it in. King Sam Bobby Boy has the AFC East. Bogey 79 has the NFC North. Brad 8671. Brad has the NFC South. Then Panthers, son. Spike Owen Kelly has the AFC South. K Nelly 3, Kevin with the AFC West. Kane Bobby Boy's second spot is NFC East. I know Kevin is interested in his Eagles Bob if you want to look at the AFC West and see if you would want to trade for one of them and try to contact him. 
MWS Mike with the AFC North. I know he would probably be interested in his Broncos. And with uh, Spike Owen Kelly, I'm sure he'd be interested in his Seahawks too. If anybody wants to propose trades to those guys, we'll try to contact them and confirm a trade if anybody wants. NFC West is Mr. Steve G.I. Budman. Seahawks. If anybody needs to see the list again, just let me know. Roll back through it here one time. Get back to the chat where I can see. You guys are saying. Let me know if there's any proposed trades for the guys that aren't here. I'll try to contact them. So I know those guys would be interested in PC teams. We usually mainly do pick your team case breaks, but with this stuff that has so many cards that ship, thought and thought it'd be nice to do some some random divisionals. Work well for prestige. Hey, it's longer than last time so far, Bob. So far, so good. They just did a bunch of changes to Breakers TV. Maybe that'll have some kind of impact too on it. Does anybody have any proposed trades? Kelly got that AFC South. That's a strong one this year's draft class. With the Texans, Deshaun Watson, the Jaguars for Leonard Fournette. Titans have a, a receiver that's really good. What's his name? Corey. Uh, there is a checklist on a group break checklist for this guy. It's the link to group break checklist is down below the video if anybody hadn't checked out the checklist yet and wants to. AFC North is strong on paper. The Cowboys still have a ton of hits in this year's product, too. The NFC East. Let's see. Yeah, I saw there's lots of Steelers and stuff, too. The Browns this year. Let's see. NFC West. Rams have a couple decent receivers. I'm blanking on the rookie class right now. I'm still, I'll be honest, I'm still learning the rookie class too. So, I'll give it a couple more minutes for trades. Uh, I know Kevin made uh, made sure to tell me to ask if anybody wants to trade the Eagles, and I know that. Spike Owen might be interested in his Seahawks, and Mike, that's not here, would probably be interested in his Broncos. If anybody's willing to trade those, let me know. I'll try to contact them. There you go, guys. It took me a second to pull it up, but here's a checklist if anybody's wondering. Yeah, the Bengals are nasty in this team. Mixon, Ross. CJ Bathard is a rookie for the 49ers. I can't think of him. Jerry Rice possibilities there. Mar Darbo for the Seahawks. You also got Russell Woods, Wilson, Marshawn Lynch, Thomas Rawls, Doug Baldwin, autographs. Carl 
Cardinals don't have a ton of stuff again this year. And the Rams are asking about the NFC West. Cooper Colt. He signed a bunch of stuff this year. He's a rookie premier. Bettis has uh, relics in there. Marshall Falk. Gurley. Tory Holt. I've seen they had Tory Holt sign a bunch of stuff for prestige too. Yeah, it's all good, Corey. Can't wait till they release the checklist for Trinity. If this stuff is good as what I've been seeing coming out, we'll be doing more Elite next week, guys. Still a couple weeks before Trinity comes out. It's been pushed back over a month now, three different times. Alright, I see a couple of y'all proposing trade. Oh, I'm going to make an attempt, guys. To contact these folks that aren't here and see if they want to trade, but I can't guarantee that I'll be able to get in touch. So what's what's the proposal, Steve, for the Seahawks? So I saw you're willing to trade the Seahawks. Kelly Spike Owen has the NS or the, excuse me, the AFC South, which is Texans, Jaguars, which are really strong. But I, Doubt he'd be willing to trade either one of them, but also the Colts and Titans. Titan, both those teams are decent. AFC South is the strongest as far as divisionally in the draft class, having two of the real big names. Bob says Eagles for Kansas City. Let's see if he's willing to do that for Kevin. Yeah, the AFC North too. The Saints had a phenomenal draft class. And obviously, you know. With McCaffrey and Samuels to the Panthers, and the Bucks had a good draft too. So the NFC South was pretty good. them both up guys we'll give it like five minutes here and see if they respond if I had to guess I would say that uh, Kevin is Kevin is at work and Kelly is probably at some sort of practice and Kevin says no for Eagles for Chiefs Give it a couple more minutes here. I'm going to go ahead and start busting them down. With Patrick Mahomes for the Chiefs, quarterback, rookie. Kevin's not willing to give him up for the Eagles. He said he's willing to bond for me, Bob. I told him to just message you and work it out. If y'all want to work something out. 
I'm going to go ahead and bust down the first box. See if uh, Kelly's responded to the Colts and Seahawks trade. I'll finally bust this one down. Got some new blinds. A little bit of different, different lighting here coming through the window. It's been a minute since we've done a break. Sun's still up, it's late. Shiny cars, these are gonna probably be tough to focus. Some base in this stuff. Tons of non numbered inserts will be shipping out to you guys, too. I believe I figured up earlier, I think it's 120 cards will be shipping in a half case, not a divisional. He's supposed to be hitting you up, Bob, so you have to work that out between the two. I'll give it about two more minutes and we're rolling on there. Steve Kelly's probably tied up. Both his sons are in sports. And I know he coaches some too. He's probably not going to respond in time either. Well, as soon as I say that, I might be him now. All right, I proposed the Broncos for Eagles to Kevin, and Kelly's checking the checklist, says he wants to do Colts for Seahawks. <clears throat> Anytime you guys have a you know a PC team that you really want, and you can't be here, just let me know. I'll you know make an attempt to work it out for you. So I don't break too long. What's up, Brother Kenny? What's going on, Primetime Sports? Welcome to the room, man. Pretty much playing GM. <laughs> if, uh, if anybody wants to jump into the second half of this, 
know, some of y'all probably want to see the first half first for you to decide, but we could always pull from the other sealed case I have. It's 89 per random division, six box half case break. Everything ships vet, vet base as usual, and if anybody wants vet base, I can ship those too. It's no problem. It's just uh, most people don't want them anyway. It's $89 per. There's seven left in the second one so far. Kane's fan Bob's only one in. We can run it right back after this one. Not much, Kenny. Getting back into the game, son. What you been up to? Just waiting to hear back from Kevin and Kelly, y'all, and, and get on with the show. Oh, man, that's no good. Never had any personal experience with that, but I know people that have, and I know that sucks. While we're waiting, I'll go ahead and hit all these with the blade. backlight for the last few months too. I'm not sure how well it'll work with these really shiny cards. We'll give it a shot here. See if it makes it look any better for you guys. <laughs> I don't know. I, I told Kevin to hit you up. I mean, I'm pretty sure y'all are friends on Facebook. Steve Kelly said he'd be down for Colts and Seahawks. He's driving and can't check anything right now, but he said he'd be down if you are. He proposed it, so. This figure, I try to help some of these guys get their PC teams, you know, and ask about it. Alright, thank you, Steve. He'll probably join us here in a minute, and thank you, too. Kelly, the super cool guy. Alright. Colts to G.I. Bloodman. Seahawks to Spike Open. Oh, Lord. You need to send me that link on Facebook or something, Hugo. See where that's at. No, Freddie Freeman is going to be in Charlotte tomorrow. They bumped him down to Triple A to get him back ready from this injury he had. Mom was telling me that today. All right, I never heard back from Kevin. We're going to roll on. 
Sorry, you guys, for such a long wait. Just trying to help these guys get their PC teams as possible. The one confirmed trade. Kevin may pop up here in a second, Bob, and respond. I don't know. I thought he was hitting up on Facebook. Let's get it. I will do a recap at the end of all the uh, autographs, guys. For anybody that may not be able to stick around the whole time. I have to check that out. Here you go. Yeah, it is going to be weird seeing him playing third. <laughs> Work out for a player to be named later. All right. Lots of numbered cards in this stuff, guys. First numbered card is 332 of 499. Carlos Henderson, rookie for the Broncos. When I first got back in and collecting in 2011, Elite was the rookie card that everybody wanted as far as non-autographed. They're all numbered. It's for the Broncos. All right. Radar is going to take a spot in the second half. So there are six left in the second half now, guys. Base, base, base. Our next number card is Michael Thomas for the Saints. Got kind of a uh, crazy looking design on it there. 118 of 149. Some of these cards are going to be really tough to get to focus well on camera. It's another good thing about doing the random divisionals that everybody's going to get a pretty hefty package, especially out of products like this, a lot of cards. Jake Butt, rookie elitist. I believe he's a stiller. So got him in his Michigan uniform on this one as a non numbered insert. Pretty cool looking insert there. This might confirm for me what team Jake Butt's on. Next insert, Spellbound, Le'Veon Bell. This one is numbered 86 of 299. My bad, misspoke. Mr. Jake Butt is a Bronco. Spellbound, Le'Veon Bell. <laughs> Bob, you had the AFC East and the NFC East. Rob Gronkowski for the Patriots, 33 of 99. Patrick Mahomes a second, 96 of 149 for the Chiefs. Gotta figure out what's gonna look the best for you guys on y'all's end with this light. Might be best without it with these super shiny cars. Next up, Darren Woodson, man coverage on as a non numbered insert. Another blank. Elite coverage is our relic out of this box. Dual relic of Derek Carr. For the Raiders. That one is non numbered. Even though it's non numbered, I will be top loading all the relics anyway. This 
63 of 149 for Davius White, rookie for the Bills. Up next. We are guaranteed one on card autograph and a second autograph per box. Three thirty six of four ninety nine Jihu Chisson. It's a name that I have not heard of for the Chiefs. Home field advantage, Matt Ryan. Let's see if this one is numbered. It is not. Another non numbered insert shipping. And Reuben Foster, 38 of 499. The 49ers there. That Bama boy. Another blank. Cool looking one here. Tom Brady and Matt Ryan face to face. 42 of 99. I didn't think about these smaller inserts coming up. Normally, when we have the smaller inserts, we just roll a die instead of doing the randomizer at the end. I didn't think about saying that at the beginning of the video. If we have any autographs or relics, we randomize eight times. A couple of people say roll. One, two, three, left side. Four, five, six, right side. We'll just roll for any of these. It'll be a little quicker. Uh, the first time I break anything, it takes quite a bit longer to break anyway. It's going to be a long break. I can find my die here. Let's we'll do these as we come to them then. One, two, three will be Brady. Four, five, six will be Matt Ryan. And it is a four. I'm going to go to the Falcons. I said we'll do that for any of the uh, small ones. If we have any autographs or relics that are duels or triples or quads, we'll do the randomizer at the end there. Still looking for two autographs here in the first box. Have another one of these face to face. Pretty cool in here. 128 of 299. Emmett Smith and Barry Sanders. Cool looking card. We'll roll again. 123 will be Emmett Smith. 456 will be Barry Sanders. It's a six. I was going to bury. Going to the lines. Tidal waves. Tom Brady. That one is a non-numbered insert. We haven't seen that one yet. And our first autograph is on car Juju Smith Schuster. Draft day. Oh, pen pals on car Juju Smith Schuster. Don't forget, guys, I do. I will do a recap of all twelve autographs at the end. We got one more hiding in here. We got our guaranteed own card. Mac Hollins, 40 of 149, rookie for the Eagles up next. And 
you have a die cut. That's pretty cool. Jihu Chison, 19 of 24. These cards bring some big money for the bigger rookies on down the line. Never know who's going to be a breakout star. I don't know a damn thing about this guy. And corners around it and die cut. I have a couple of those out of the uh, 2012 Elite. So for decent money. College ties. Derek Barnett and Alvin Kamara. I know Alvin Kamara is a saint. Not sure about Derek Barnett. That one's not numbered. And our other autograph is a turn of the century, numbered four of only ten, Jeremy McNichols. I know uh, Radar Jesse be interested in that one. The other autograph he missed five was Juju Smith Schulster. the Steelers. McNichols to 10. Cool ass design on those. And we had a couple base. Our non-numbered insert here, I guess we'll roll on them too. There's two different teams there. Uh, <coughs> Eagles for Barnett. Kamara is Saints. So 1, 2, 3, Barnett. 4, 5, 6, Kamara. And that one's going to the right side again. All three done so far have been right side. Alright, guys. I know that was kind of brutal with the uh, long session there for trades. I uh, took my time through that first box here. Try to speed it up a little bit from here on out. Trying to lay out of the product and all. <clears throat> Look back at any of the breaks I've done. The first first case is always a little longer than the rest. That's a pretty nice first box. The designs are pretty on point. I'm digging the designs. Turn century looks way cool. Got like a wave design. That's probably because it's number 10. Not that specific design. Let's see, we we'll pull another one. Just to give you an idea, too, guys, there's a lot of, a lot of numbered stuff shipping. So we're down to six spots in the next one. We might also jump in. Jesse grabbed a spot here just a minute ago through text. And Bob and Jesse are in. Totally depending on what you guys want to do. If you want to do uh, the other half of this case, or we can always open up a full case down for whatever. You can also do some personal boxes if anybody wants. Do plan on doing more elite next week. If you dig the product, come hang out with us. No admission to hang out, just saying. Appreciate that coming through.
packs are a little like the actual material they're used for the packs this year are a little different than normal. They're foil, but they have this weird coating on them. So they're ripping all weird. Alright, box number two, we'll get it. We'll see what we got. First numbered rookie is 174 of 499. I believe to speed up the process. Do the top load and after the break on these numbered cards. Make it go a little quicker for us here. 36 of 99, Jordan Lewis, rookie for the Cowboys. That most of these guys are showing in their NFL uniforms. We saw the one guy for the 49ers that was still in his Bama uniform. Another blank. Oh, Luke Keekley, man coverage. Non numbered insert. And we have another face to face JJ Watt and Andrew Luck. This one is numbered Gold Parallel, numbered 14 of 25. 14 of 25. I don't know if that's gold or more like a bronze. No need to roll on that one. It's in the same division. That Luke Keekly is pretty cool looking too. Especially being not even numbered. These are kind of neat. I've never seen anything exactly like these. Another non numbered. Antonio Brown. I'm sure there are numbered versions there. Oh, this one is numbered. Pretty sure the other one like this wasn't. 268 of 299. Maybe I'm thinking wrong. Maybe it was. Antonio Brown for the Steelers. 268 of 299. All these are numbered. My bad. So many different inserts. Next one up is 33 of 74, Le'Veon Bell, red parallel for the Steelers. We were talking earlier, so many Steelers in this product. Right behind that, speaking of, 19 of 99, James Conner. This is somebody I'll be looking for a couple autographs of. Oh, you're right. I forgot about our trade. Thanks for speaking up, Steve. I wasn't even thinking about the trade. The Colts were, were done on trade, so that is going to be a uh, dice roll. My bad, man. Thanks for pointing that out. So, one, two, three, Texans, four, five, six, Colts. Forgot about our one trade there. Good luck, guys. Pretty cool card. That one is going to the Colts. Right side, taking them all so far. Congrats, Steve. Not bad on that one, man. Home field advantage. Mr. Cameron Newton, non-numbered insert, very cool looking. Man, I like the base design way better than last year. And pretty nice relic, Larry Fitzgerald. Larry Fitzgerald for the Cardinals, 49 of 75 Pro Bowl standouts. There's no one for you, Steve. Cardinals are one of the weaker teams overall. There's a nice one for them. Little chunky two color patch there. Some crazy looking design on that one, the Pro Bowl patch. Ninety nine of ninety nine, Jay Stu, Jonathan Stewart for the Panthers. Two thirty eight of four ninety nine, Trayvon Durrell, Ricky for the Saints. And there's another one where he's actually in his uh, com uh, combine. 
here. Pitcher from the combine. Tidal wave, Jerry Rice for the 49ers. That one is non numbered. Another one looks cool as hell. Tidal waves. And 495 of 499 for the 49ers, Trent Taylor. For the 49ers. So far, this is a GI Budman box. And we have another Antonio Brown, this time the O spell bound. This one is a parallel number 40 of 99 for the Steelers. And we have another face to face. Vontae's perfect. And Antonio Brown. This one is numbered 266 of 299. Both going to the same division, so no need to roll on that one. Seems like anything Charles Woodson's been selling well. That one is non numbered. Charles Woodson and Jabril Peppers. Yeah, there's just, just a few stillers in the product. Charles Woodson and Jabril Peppers. So, Raiders and Browns. Check. Raiders and Browns around. Well, even though it's not numbered, we'll roll on it. It is shipping. One, two, three Raiders, four, five, six Browns. See if the right side keeps taking it. And that's, that's so crazy. Was that the fifth one now, and all have been right side? And we come down to a small stack and still have both autographs again. Box number two. There's one of them. Turn of the century. It is a nice one. Two of 25. Leonard Fournette for the Jaguars. Pretty card right there. Two of 25. Yes, sir. Pretty sweet. And we still have another one that'll be a guaranteed on card in this box. 70 of 70, kind of an odd number in there. A little weak bottom right corner, too. For the Dolphins, Cordria Tankersley. Ricky. Blank. Die cut number nine of twenty four, Robert Davis for the Redskins. It's a little different than the other die cut we got earlier. Jabril Peppers, rookie elitist. That one is non numbered. And Pen Pals, Kenny Galloway. Nice penmanship there by Kenny G. A couple of base off the back. Lions with a pen pal hit. He sure did just sign Kenny G. It's a nice looking autograph though. All I know about him is he's a wide receiver. I don't know how good he is. So in the box number three. I'll say a little quicker there.
box too. <laughs> what you guys think of this stuff? I think it's cool to do the divisionals on these. These products have so many card chips and so many packs. Yeah, it's to me, Justin, it's like prestige, man. And, you know, unless you guys want me to, I don't even plan on bringing prestige back. And I'm just being honest. I, I thought prestige was better than, than I was thinking it would be. Last couple of years, I think they've made both these products better. I know people are still a little skittish over prestige because even uh, the autographs are still in college uniforms, but still have those NFL logos on it. I actually dug both these products. I to pick me up some of these own cards out of both of my Panthers guys one of these days. Yeah. Yeah, well, I'm running these pretty cheap in the grand scheme of things, too. Uh, shipping on something where so many cards ship like this, pick your team style, just, you know, just get could have talking about 70 bucks if I was a ship after every case. And I'm at just for shipping, so. But since I do priority, it ends up being about down divisionals, I guess, anyway. But. Pretty nice stuff. Some low number stuff, too, so far, too. Autograph and non auto. Shoot, we already had autographs of 10 and the 25 in the first two boxes. I don't know, some of you guys probably know Justin, and some might not. It's been a while since he's hung out with us. Jay Rotulio, if I'm not butchering your name, but Justin used to break with me a lot back in like 13 and 14. It's good to hear from you, man. Welcome back. Good to see you back around. We all start learning more about this draft class and more products coming out. Start doing things more steady again. I know that's right. I've always thought that was a cool idea. I mean, even at one time in Elite, the base rookies were numbered to 499. They're still parallel numbered less, but I mean, 499 is a pretty high number, but. I don't know. Numbered rookies is a good idea, I agree. Oh, wow, really? Yeah, we still, you know, it's a smaller group, but I got a good group of dudes that come and hang out with me, man, and try to weed out anybody that's going to cause any problems or just be a dick. A lot of places you'll see just anarchy in the chat room, and as long as somebody's spending money, they're allowed to say and do whatever they want. And I just, I know that turns a lot of people, including myself, off, so I try to make it a little different place here. For the Chargers, 363 of 499, Mike Williams, one of those rookies, like I was just talking about, the 499. I agree. <laughs> I might be a little biased. But I agree. It's a 499 Mike Williams. So shiny. 54 of 90 Tyreek Hill for the Chiefs. Home field advantage. Marcus Mariota for the Titans. That was non numbered. Spellbound, Julio Jones. That one is 132 of 299. 47 of 149, Josh Reynolds for the Rams.
me say I see some people. Some people having issues losing video. I'll give it just a second here for the refresh. They just did some updates of breakers. I couldn't tell it affected me, but. It's one that I don't use a lot of the, uh, I don't use the same way to cast a lot of them do. Because I don't put all those spreadsheets and stuff all over the screen. Poor Steve, it looks like he's having a hard time here. Steve, are you back with us, buddy? A big release day too. It's probably overloading the servers with so many people on. Over 40 casters on. Hey Brad, what's going on, buddy? We on box number three, Brad. And you have the NFC South. Some people are having some uh, issues right now with breakers. So I'm going to give it a second to get them back. So I'll do a little recap for you. See, you have a Michael Thomas to 149. You had some cool non numbered Panthers inserts Cam Newton, Luke Keekley. Some I haven't top loaded here yet for the sake of time. I don't believe you had any in there. We did have a, a Trayvon Durrell rookie to 499. Jonathan Stewart to 99. And here's a little peek in our four autographs so far in the first two boxes. Kenny Galloway for the Lions. Turn of the century, Leonard Fournette to 25. To 10, Jeremy McNichols for the Bucks. And I know Radar Jesse would be interested in this one. That's your card. That's uh, he's a big Bucks fan. And Juju Smith Schulster for the Steelers. I definitely li I'll link you up with Jesse. You'll want to buy that one for sure. And I put things on hold since Steve and a couple people had issues. I see Steve said he's back. And we had a 47 to 149 Josh Reynolds rookie. Steve's division and the Rams up next and we'll carry on. One thirty of one forty nine Carson Wentz and the Eagles. The title away Terrell Davis for the Broncos. That one's non numbered. Really cool with an insert though. Uh, there's another one for the Bucks. Pro Bowl standouts. Jameis Winston. That ooh, <laughs> Panthers, I just saw that. Some of these relics are not numbered, which I'm kind of surprised by. I guess you would call that one three color. It's got a couple of colors in the black there from the shoulder. And that one is non numbered. We are running this back, guys. If anybody's interested, we've got six spots left in another random divisional half case. Um, I see Steve still having problem with breakers, guys. I can uh, I can cast on other other forums. You know, I could do Facebook Live. We could do YouTube. But the more uh, different ways I cast, the more possible issues are liable to pop up. And it seems that all of us being in the same spot in the same chat room is definitely the way to go to keep things rolling. 137 to 149, Matt Stafford for the Lions. I know it sucks. I don't know what I can say to help on that. 214 of 499, Curtis Samuel. For the Panthers. And we have Jimmy Graham, who's now on the Seahawks, and David Njoku. I might need some help on that one. 
T A. I'm not sure. I'm not even going to guess. Somebody tell me who uh, David Njoko plays for now. This is non number. For any of these smaller cards, anything that's non autoed or relics, we're just doing a dice roll one, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. Browns. Seahawks, Browns. One, two, three. Seahawks. Four, five, six. Browns. It is a five. Going to the brown. We haven't hit an autograph in box three yet, so we still got at least one guaranteed on card and a second one coming as well. 19 to 499, Elijah McGuire for the Jets. This one's pretty cool. Haven't seen one of these yet. Family ties. Michael Bennett. And Martellus Bennett. And that one is number 220 of 299. Looks like something out of Totally uh, Certified. That is pretty damn cool. So, dice roll again. 1, 2, 3, Seahawks. 4, 5, 6, Packers. That one is a 1. That one is going to the Seahawks. Alvin Kamara, rookie elitist for the Saints. That one is non numbered. And then Pin Pal snuck up on us there. Samaje P. Ryan for the Redskins. Look out for this guy. I believe that he is a uh, up and comer for sure. Underestimated. I agree. Samaje P. Ryan. We still got another autograph here in box three. We are running this back for anybody that's just joining us. So a few people popped in the chat. I don't have it in the store, but it's 89 a spot. Random divisionals. Half case break. Six boxes. There's <clears throat> guaranteed on card autograph in a box. Second autograph and a relic. So it'll be 12 total autographs and six relics. Plus tons of other stuff shipping. 137 of 149. Eli Manning. There's six spots left in the second half. If anybody wants to jump in. Field Vision. I saw these on the preview and thought they looked pretty neat. Field Vision. Derek Carr. That one is numbered 88 of 99. Fourteen of twenty-four. These die cuts, crazy. 14 of 24, Antonio Brown. Another short print die cut. I know Steve probably taking the Steelers and all the pick your teams you see for this. Let's some Steelers. Main coverage, Steve Atwater for the Broncos. Non numbered on that one. And. Last hit of this box, two of 99, Deshaun Kaiser. Deshaun Kaiser for the Browns. That is the highest numbered autograph we've seen so far, which, I, well, we got the pin pals, but they aren't numbered. On the Antonio Brown box, I was thinking the same thing. see who ended up with the Browns and the random. Uh, Mike, MWS. Mike has the uh, AFC North. Uh, so far, as far as the Panthers, only have a Curtis Samuel rookie to 499. I believe it was, and uh, some non numbered inserts. This is a random divisional break. We are running this back, guys, for anybody interested. 
Just saying. So far, Bob and Jesse are in. So six spots left. I have another fresh case too. Oh, you're watching, Clay. Mike is Michael S on the Facebook group. If you want to link up with him on there? I'm pretty sure he's the only Michael S. See him in the tags. He's a big Broncos fan. I was saying anything about how long a full case break of this would be with so many you know, number cards to show. It's be pretty long here. Did anybody get the email today that hasn't been getting it? I'm trying to send it different ways. I'm realizing that some people have never gotten it, but they've been on the list for a long time. Uh, it's probably y'all's email server on y'all's end, but I thought I'd try some different things on mine. Send it a different way than usual. I'm going to try it several different ways. Some of you guys that hadn't been getting it hopefully got it today. Also, if anybody doesn't follow the channel, the little heart right in the bottom corner, please follow. You, sh you should be getting an email from Breakers when I go live as well. And all my links are down below the video. We do a lot of uh, stuff through the Facebook group exclusively now. Most everybody has Facebook these days, and it's easy and convenient for everybody. So we can get things going without actually being live. We actually filled this break that I'm breaking right now last night 100% all eight spots filled before we ever went live today if you're interested in the second half stick around and get it going next box number four let's get it let's see what we got the camera focus in here right off the bat uh oh <laughs> Uh oh, what's this? Oh, fake out big time. Wow. Home field advantage. <laughs> Aaron Rodgers. I thought we had an Aaron Rodgers autograph. Not even numbered. Big time fake out. We had a partial pack that was turned around backwards. Just three cards turned around backwards. Big time fake out on that one. Might have a whole box that way. Let's see what we got going on here. Juju Chisum, 464 of 499 for Chis. Let's see, we got another one turned around backwards here. 88 of 99 spellbound Julio Jones for the Falcons. It's the second one of these for Julio. I think the other one was a J. Pretty cool looking. Yeah, it looks like this whole box is flipped around all different ways. Odell Beckham. Spellbound for the Giants. That one is 225 of 299. 
Big Ben tidal waves. Non numbered insert. And how about a James Connor pen pals? If you guys don't know this guy's story, YouTube it, check it out, pretty cool. Wouldn't mind having that myself for the old PC. Being a long time Steelers fan before the Panthers existed. Grew up the whole family Steelers fans. James Conner, home card. Yeah, I had to have a couple of him for sure. Get with you on that. Had to get a couple of autos of him. Blank, blank. Matt Stafford for the Lions, seven of one forty-nine. Couple off of the jersey number. Chad Williams, nine of twenty, excuse me, three of twenty-four for the Cardinals die cut. Not familiar with Mr. Chad Williams. And we have Mike Williams and Deshaun Watson. Where did Mike Williams go? Blinking. Deshaun Watson's Texans. College ties. That one is non numbered. We'll roll for it anyway. Chargers on Mike Williams. One, two, three, Chargers. Four, five, six, Texans. It is a one. One is going to the Chargers. Second autograph in box number four is turn of the century, 27 of 99, Jonathan Allen. Jersey number inscribed, them Redskins. Kelly, what's up, buddy? I just noticed your name in the room. I'm going to do a recap of all the autographs at the end, guys. There is so much stuff shipping out of this, this product, though. <laughs> it picked up to recap everything. Uh, some of the relics aren't numbered, which I'm kind of surprised about. But we have not seen really a dud autograph yet. One fifty-five of four ninety-nine, Donta Foreman for the Texans rookie. Seventy of eighty-nine, Marvin Jones Jr. for the Lions. Cards sticking together here. All base. Alitas Jabril Peppers, non numbered insert for the Browns. Pretty cool looking field vision. Big Ben. Just because the servers are overloaded, guys, it's a big release day. Spectra basketball, elite football, torque racing. Servers are overloaded. Plus, some of y'all are having problems with breakers. What's up, Jesse? That one is 175 of 299. So far, I have King Sam Bob and Radar for spots in the second half of this. If anybody else wants in, let me know. 89 of 99, Derek Barnett for the Eagles. 40 of 99, Julio Jones for the Falcons. Sean Lee, man coverage. Cool picture on that one. Cowboys, non numbered. And there's a relic. Relic is a two swatch, two different colors. Derrick Henry for the Titans Elite Coverage. That's my only negative thought about this product so far, as I don't understand why the relics aren't numbered. We did have one that was numbered to 25. It's a Pro Bowl relic, but 
most of the relics aren't numbered in the product. So not everybody's really just looking for the autographs anyway. I guess it's not that big a deal. 32 of 80, Jalen Ramsey for the Jags. And that is box number four. Thought it had Romo laying on the field. <laughs> Quick little glance. By the way, as far as uh, the second one, if you guys decide to open up the fresh case and do six boxes from the fresh case, I don't mind. If y'all think that we got the best of the case in the first half, which I don't think so, we did have some nice stuff, but you never know. We can do whatever you guys want, throw them down. We had Jonathan Allen, James Conner, Sean Kaiser, 99. Some Aj P ride. You'll probably want to talk to Brad about this one. Four of ten, Jeremy McNichols, turn of the century. I'll be down for that too, for sure. We can get enough people on board, Brad. This one has a high price point. To twenty-five, Leonard Fournette, turn of the century. Kenny Galloway and Juju smith schulster I'm definitely down for that too. Anybody else interested in the full case? We can do the full case. Maybe 179 per spot. Yeah, I already let him know, Jesse. I knew you'd be interested in that one. Now let me know who that one ships to. Yep. I'm doing this at the same price that, you know, everybody, as far as, you know, reputable breakers that I know, that I you know, pay attention to anyway. Are doing it as far as random teams. Just broken down divisionals instead. So, cheap. If you guys decide you would really do a full, we can get try filling the full next. We can always run some Ace Boogie Wilson specials. Down for whatever. We do already have Bob and Jesse down for the half case next. I know Corey over there is waiting for a big hit so he can double down on another spot. <laughs> So from what I'm seeing from it so far, I'm definitely going to be getting more cases for next week. Um, the only reason why I haven't been lying and pick your teams is because I haven't been around as much here lately. And when I had been live, there hadn't been a whole lot of folks showing up. Um, I'm not totally opposed to doing some pick your team. We can get it rolling. I thought this would be quicker and easier for us to fill. We have some action. To get feedback from you guys. If we get enough people on board, I'm down for every owner in it. Brad, I appreciate you posting when you get big hits. Small Oslanders breaks, I think that's pretty cool. I mean, I had a, one of my nephews talking about that the other day. He was one of the ones that liked that post. I think this draft class is going to sneak up on a lot of folks. There is always a lot of negativity at the beginning every year. Just think about last year, nobody knew anything about Dakota Prescott. If you said anything about a Cowboys rookie, everybody was talking about Zeke. Look at 2014 when we were breaking Trinity and we were like, Odell Beckham, who is that? <laughs> we don't even know yet. Yeah, hell yeah. 
it's like uh, I'm always hesitant to tag y'all on post, but I tagged a bunch of y'all today and last night. Anytime that y'all make comments on on social media on the Facebook group, if you you know like it and comment on it, more people see it. Then I mean that's how it works. So anytime y'all feel free, speak out, post some nice shit you got. Feel free to link the Facebook group to people that might be interested. Or you know, wow, wow, out of nowhere, four or five prime numbers. Four or five prime numbers, Andrew Luck. That's the only trade we had was Colts for Seahawks. Now we gotta get Kelly some Seahawks hits here. That one does say player worn. Bottom corners on the front are a little weak. Not bad though. Not real noticeable. That's definitely the nicest patch we've seen. Tidal waves. Big Ben. Two twelve of four ninety nine. Malachi Dupree for Green Bay. 94 of 149, Devontae Adams for Green Bay. Derek Barnett and Alvin Kamara. I'll tell you what, we had this one earlier. I'm just going to uh, give both teams one instead of rolling the die again. It's non numbered anyway, and both those teams will be getting one of those. And we have another one. For the duel, 186 of 299, Ray Lewis and Eddie George face to face. 1, 2, 3 will be Ray Lewis. 4, 5, 6 will be Eddie George. Camera okay, having a real tough time focusing on that one. We'll carry on. One, two, three, Ravens, four, five, six, Titans. That one was going to the Titans. Odell Beckham. I think it's the second one of those we've seen. That one's 62 of 99. And there's a lower numbered parallel, a regular one. And we have Pin Pals for the Chargers. Mike Williams. Just asking about this guy earlier. Can't remember what team he went to. Was a beast in college. Pen pals, Mike Williams. Elite son. So we got a relic and our own car. We still got another autograph coming in this one. Cordrea Tankersley for the Dolphins, 353 of 499. 54 of 149. Aaron Jones for the Packers. 231 of 499. Joe Williams for the 49ers. Dalvin Cook, rookie elitist. For the Vikings, non numbered. Ed Reed, man coverage, non numbered for the Ravens. 23 of 149, Phillip Rivers for the Chargers. And last little stack here of box number 5, 14 of 99, Eli Rogers. For the Steelers, I don't believe we've had our die cut in this one yet. What is this? We got a redemption. There's our other autograph. Look weird. Some thin stock. Pen pals. 
So this is actually doubling up on on-card autographs. This will be another pin pal on card. Zay Jones. Even though that's for redemption, I always top load the autographs anyway. Yep, that one is going to the Bills. My bad. East Carolina boy. I'm real familiar with him. <laughs> Zay Jones. That's pretty cool. We ended up with two on card autographs. Now, this box Le'Veon Bell. Number 244 of 299. Home field advantage, J.J. Watt, non numbered. 11 of 99, Jeremy Curley for the 49ers. 59 of 99, Tim Williams for the Ravens. Guess we did have our die cut early on. That's the end of box five. All right, last box, guys. Good luck. Started out top loading everything as we came to it numbered wise. I realized pretty quick after the first couple of boxes that was going to make this long video even longer. Just to give you all an idea, this was just the top loaded stuff out of the first box. So you imagine six boxes more will be top loaded. Just to give you an idea, there'll be a ton of stuff shipping. Uh, there's some more non numbered stuff shipping. And we got our autographs and our relics over here too. One of the reasons why I decided to do these random divisionals is so many cards and prestige and elite. I'll be enjoying those that way. Like I was saying a little bit ago, if we can get everybody on board with Pick Your Team, we can go back to Pick Your Team on Elite. I think this is a pretty cool way to do it, though. Everybody gets a good chunky package this way. I know Brad said so he's down for a full case divisional. That'd be 179 a spot. We have Bob and Jesse Radar. It's already down for uh, a run back of the half caser. That's 89 a spot. So we'd have six left in that. And if anybody decides they want personal boxes, we can do that as well. Last box for this break here. I don't have the breaks in the store, personal boxes are there. We're doing a lead all next week. If you guys haven't joined the Facebook group, the link's down below. We throw a lot of breaks through there. This particular break we're breaking filled before uh, they were dumped on today, filled last night. And there's always a pinned post at the top of the Facebook group <clears throat> that gives everybody a rundown of what products are going to be breaking in here and when they come out, all that good stuff. 380 of 499, George Kittle for the 49ers. Next up, Charles Woodson and Jabril Peppers, school ties. We had one of those earlier, so just like before, I'll make sure both teams get one of those. This is not numbered. 328 of 499, Malik McDowell. Looking all serious for the Seahawks. And we have a dual pin pal for the Rams. Cooper Colt and Josh Reynolds. That practice squad stare down. 
Uh, same as Prestige. You go over there, 119, everything ships priority. It's the exact same price as Prestige. Cooper Colt and Josh Reynolds. Cooper Colt signed some cool inscriptions. I don't know what product's going to be in, but I was checking it out on the when you sign it at the rookie premiere. Face to face. Michael Crabtree and Richard Sherman. This will be numbered 255 of 299. 1, 2, 3. It will go to the Raiders. 4, 5, 6. It will go to the Seahawks. Yeah, that one is going to the Raiders. Ricky Elias, Jabril Peppers, that is non numbered for the Browns. 16 of 24 is going to be our last die cut as a rookie for the Bucks. Sefo Leafu, probably butchering that name, but. Forty-nine of one forty-nine, Miles Garrett for the Brownies. One nineteen of four ninety-nine, Ricky James Connor for the Steelers. Clay Matthews, man coverage. Not numbered for the Packers. And there's our other autograph. Turn of the century, Chris Godwin, 134 of 149 for the Bucks. One thirty four, one forty nine, turn of the century. One twenty three at one forty nine, Ryan Tannehill, the Dolphins, Thomas Rawl, seventy three at ninety nine. The Seahawks. Home field advantage. Matt Ryan. The Falcons. Fired up. Hadn't seen one of those yet. That looks cool as hell. Des Bryant. Fired up. 39 of 299. Expect that one to be numbered a little lower there. It's cool as it looks. Definitely looking like some totally certified. Field Vision, Cameron Newton. That looks like a purple parallel. That one is numbered 42 of 49. That NFC South, son. Huh? Yeah, there's several people having problems, Jesse. I apologize, guys, for y'all that are having issues with the site. Oh, we actually have another die cut in this one. Two of 24, Nathan Peterman. For the Bills, rookie. Tidal Waves, Jerry Rice. That is a non numbered insert. And Ezekiel Elliott, Elite Coverage, Dual Relic. Those are non numbered. Devontae Adams to 149, 23 of 149. And that is the break. I had a guy asking me the other day why we don't ship base. That's why we don't ship base. <laughs> so we got some non numbered stuff shipping here. This is all going to be top loaded, which by the time it's top loaded, it will be you know, this high. Do a recap of our autographs. Relics I have not top loaded it either, just for the sake of time. This is a long break. We got Ezekiel Elliott Elite Coverage Dual Relic, the Andrew Luck 405 Prime Numbers. 
Derrick Henry, elite coverage, dual relic, Pro Bowl standouts, Jameis Winston, and the only other one was numbered as 45 of 75, Larry Fitzgerald, and Derek Carr. We can make it happen, Jesse. And our 12 autographs, 134 of 149. Chris Godwin for the Bucks. Cooper Colt and Josh Reynolds, dual pen pals autograph. Zay Jones for the Bills pen pal. Redemption is the only redemption in, in the uh, six boxes. Mike Williams pen pals for the Chargers. The Lions, Kenny Galloway. For the Steelers, Juju Smith Schulster. Leonard Fournette, 2 of 25, turn of the century for the Jags. For the Bucks, 4 of 10, Jeremy McNichols. Samaj P. Ryan. Redskins. 2 of 99, Deshaun Kaiser, turn of the century. And James Conner, Pin Pals. And 27 of 99, Jonathan Allen, turn of the century. Appreciate you guys. I'll have this up on YouTube a little bit later for those of you that make it in time. I tried to wait a little later tonight. There's still uh, with a few guys that couldn't make it. But I will have a video up if you want to check out the entire break. I'm going to stop the video here. As always, thank y'all. Oslanders break, son.